Hey guys, Chef Jason, your Ace Hardware Grilling Expert, hanging out here, Backyard Grill Stadium. Today, we're doing a gear review, right? Uh, I get to do a lot of cool stuff on the grills and a lot of recipes, but I tell you what, I always love when I get to do a gear review because I like sharing with you some of the cool tools I use to produce some amazing food. Today, it's all about the big green egg. We are going to make you a genius with the Egg Genius. Do a little gear flyover. There you have it, the Egg Genius. Now, in every box, you're going to get some care instructions and some tips and advice as well. But then, look at this. You're gonna get two adapter plates. So, one for your larger sized eggs and one for your smaller sized eggs. You're gonna get that beautiful Wi-Fi unit, the Egg Genius. That thing is fantastic. Obviously, we need to power this so you're gonna get a power cord. And then, here's my pro tip. I like to keep my uh, probes in a Ziploc bag when I'm done. So you're gonna get a pit temperature probe that has that cool alligator clip, and then you're going to get temperature probes as well. Now, if you're looking for an add-on, look at that, the Y cable. That will allow you to have one, two pit probes and two temp probes at the same time. We'll go ahead and get this fire started in the middle. You know I like it there when I'm doing that low and slow cooking because it really has a chance to burn down and in. Gives me just a fantastic, fantastic fire. So we'll get this guy started. We've got it ignited now. Time to get that fan kicked in and get this thing all ready to go. Okay, because we're on the extra large egg, we're gonna use the extra large adapter plate. Now what I'm gonna do, slide that screen over Cover that guy up just a little bit. Slide that flap over just like that. Now, pretty simple, right guys? Check this out. All you do is hook this on. The Egg Genius works best when that regulator top is barely open, right? So we've got, I don't know, what do you think guys? Quarter inch there? Set that to the top, barely open. Now, let's head down below, get everything plugged in. Then we're gonna fire up the app and show you how to get this thing adjusted because uh, we've got a chicken we're gonna throw in here for dinner tonight. Okay, real quick, let's get this plugged in. So we know the pit temperature is that black probe. We're gonna get that plugged in. We're gonna get the meat probe plugged in. And now we'll go ahead and get this set back in there. Now, listen, the minute you plug those temp probes in, you can actually hear the fan kick in because now the Egg Genius is ready to go to work. We hooked up the Egg Genius to the bottom. It is time now to uh, grab our convector and go ahead and get that in there because now we uh, want to get it set up to get ready for the pit temperature. So I'm going to grab the guy with the alligator clip, right? And what I'm going to do is go ahead and stick that right here. Now, I want to make sure I have a good distance from the side of the convector because I don't want that heat to come up and affect my temperature probe. Talk about Awesome, this is like a remote control for your big green egg. So look at this, I'm making it public, which means I have the ability to share it. Now, that is our pit temperature, currently at 98 degrees based on where we put the alligator clip. Let's go ahead and adjust this. So we're gonna set that to a temperature of 375 degrees, because we're gonna roast this uh, nice and fast. Now look at this, I can also set a pit alarm. So if I have a 20 degree variance, plus or minus, it will now let me know. I'm gonna go ahead and hit set, it is updated and we are good to go. Now you can see set temperature 375, that is at 99 degrees, but look at that, 100% fan output, meaning that fan is working overtime right now to get everything where we need it. We are fully preheated, it is time to load our uh, prep chicken. So we just have a nice whole roasted chicken here that we uh, are going after for dinner, and I'm gonna get that guy all set and ready to go, but I wanna show you where to load this probe uh, to get the most effective use out of this Egg Genius. So I'm gonna go ahead and load that down into the thickest part of the breast. And now we're gonna go ahead and program an alarm temperature on the Egg Genius app. We'll set that for 160 degrees, uh, ensuring that it carries over and our chicken finishes to 165. That is pretty simple. We're gonna let the egg do the rest. Ear gadgets and grills, right? It's like the absolute amazing night on Grill Stadium. And I'll tell you, I'm not letting anyone in on the secret of the egg genius. I want them to think I slaved over a hot grill all day long making some amazing food. And today, that chicken definitely delivered an exceptional, easy uh, meal for us to enjoy in my house. The beauty of the egg genius really is uh, allowing us to connect to the grill, right? And take to that technology level, but then really gives us more time to hang out with our family 
family and friends that have come over to enjoy a little barbecue time in Grill Stadium. Hey, I'm Chef Jason Morris, race hardware grilling expert. Thanks so much for hanging out with us and cooking tonight. Uh, we're excited to show you a little bit of gear. Don't forget, you can head down below to that description section. We've got a great little tip sheet uh, that's going to walk you through everything Egg Genius related. We're going to show you all the tips and tricks. And then don't forget my uh, chef's tip of the day. Store those temperature probes in Ziploc bags. Hey, then while you're down there, don't forget to leave us a comment. Tell us what would you like to see and how can we be more helpful? Then, as always, we ask you to share this content, share these videos, and subscribe to our Ace Hardware YouTube channel. Then, coming up at the end of this, Allison's got two more amazing Big Green Egg videos ready for you to click follow along and absolutely drool. Thank you again for hanging out with us here in Grill Stadium. Look forward to seeing you at your local Ace Hardware.